Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to show you how to install Zero's minimap for Minecraft version 1.12. Let's get started. In the description down below you'll find a link to Minecraft Forge and Zero's minimap. But keep in mind these were just updated to 1.12 so they could have some bugs. But I've tested Forge so I'm assuming Zero's minimap is working as well. But just keep that in mind so if you want to back up your saves just in case that would be a wise thing to do. But anyways, you want to go to download latest, you want to click installer. Now take this page right here, it will tell you, wait 6 seconds, don't click the ads, just click skip, and it will download to your computer. It will say the file will harm your computer, but it actually won't, it's just being cautious. It's just an unknown publisher, so click keep, and that will download. Now go to Zero's Minimap, and when you're here you want to scroll down to download Zero's Minimap. It will take you to Chocolate Minecraft, and when you're here, you want to go all the way down to download full mod, and right here. 1.12 click download so on this page do not click start download that is an ad right here you want to click skip there's like it wait, tells you to wait like five seconds click skip and it will download and just like forge it's not harmful just an unknown publisher click keep and there you go now i will meet you at the desktop okay so first thing you want to do is go to minecraft and you want to run version 1.12 so if you have not you want to look in here go to 1.12 latest release and click play so there we go, Minecraft 1.12 right there, and you have to do this so Forge can recognize that you ran the version that it's trying to install. So click quit game, go to your downloads, and take both them out, just drop them there, exit this, and first what you want to do is take Forge, and you want to right click it, open with Java TM Platform SE Binary, click install client, click OK, and it will download the libraries. There we go, it's successful. Click OK. Now open up Minecraft. And when you're here, you want to go to Launch Options. And click Add New. And then just name this like Minecraft Forge. You want to click this little arrow right here. And look for Forge 1.12. So release 1.12 Forge. And turn this, this is usually off, turn that on. And just, just so you can make your screen bigger if you want. Just click Save, so that's good. Click Save. Go back to News and look for the version right there minecraft forge 1.12 click play so you'll see this loading screen and this just means it's working so just wait a bit and it should be pretty quick so there we go forge installed as you can see down there four mods loaded mods and forge and everything that you installed with it is right there now quick game for zero's minimap you want to press windows key and r on your keyboard it'll bring up an application called run and you want to type in percent %APPDATA% percent. click OK go to dot .minecraft and you want to go to the mods folder, if there's not a mods folder right click press new folder and name it MODS just like that no caps and that's if you don't have one if you have one you're good but if you don't do that go to the mods folder take zero's minimap just place it in there and there you go now open up minecraft so make sure it's still selected so 1.12 forge click play so there we go, 5 mods loaded, go to mods, and right there, Zero's minimap, and obviously it's installed and it works, but I'm going to show you it in one of my worlds. So the corner right there, there's the map, and you can go to settings, you can press escape and go to, I believe it's options, minimap settings, or you can press Y, and it will bring up the same settings I just went to, and you can change a ton of settings in here, so you can make waypoints, and I'm pretty sure you press B, it's like the key bind, you press B, and it will make waypoints. Or you can click there, make waypoints, and there's a ton of things on this map that you can edit. Like, where is it? You can edit stuff in cave. You can edit the entities that pop up, change their colors and stuff. And this mod is just really, really cool. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, or I helped you out, leave a like down below and subscribe to join the Bomb Squad today.